இப்போ முள்ளு மலரும் பண்ணும்போது அது அது பார்க்கும்போது இட்ஸ் வெரி யூனிக் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஃபிலிம் அண்ட் அண்ட் அந்த திங் வந்து இது தங்கப்பதக்கம் எழுதினவர்கள் பண்ண படம்னு நம்பவே முடியாது பிகாஸ் த சென்சிபிலிட்டிஸ் ஐ மீன் ஐ எம் நாட் சேங் ஒன் இஸ் பெட்டர் ஆர்டர் பிகாஸ் இட் டூ டிஃப்ரெண்ட் டைப்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஃபிலிம்ஸ் பட் அந்த சென்சிபிலிட்டி அந்த படத்தில் அந்த டெலிகேட் இவ்வளோ சைலன்ஸோட ஒரு நேச்சுரல் பேஸோட அந்த ரியலிசமோட பட் ஆல்சோ வித் த ட்ராமா அந்த அந்த சென்சிபிலிட்டி யூ திங்க் இட் இட் வாஸ் இம்பைப் ஃப்ரம் பாலு மகேந்திரா நான் வந்து ஜானி படத்தில் நான் வந்து அஸ்டண்ட்டாக ஒர்க் பண்ணும்போது இந்த மாதிரி லைட்டு இங்கே இருக்கும்போது அந்த லைட்டை இப்படி இப்படி போட்டுட்டு இருந்தேன் அப்போது வந்து மகேந்திரன் சார் தான் கூப்பிட்டார் கூப்பிட்டு ஃபஸ்ட்டு டைம் நீ பார்க்குற இல்லை ஒரு ஷூட்டிங்கை ஃபுல்லாக பார்க்குற உனக்கு சினிமா வந்து இஃப் யூ வாண்ட் டு அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் சினிமா தட் இஸ் நாட் த பிளேஸ் டு பி தட் இஸ் அன் ஆடியன்ஸ் பாயிண்ட் ஆஃப் வியூ யூ ஹாவ் டு பி ஃப்ரம் த மேக்கர்ஸ் பாயிண்ட் ஆஃப் வியூ ஸோ அதனால் என்ன பண்ணு கேமரா பக்கத்தில் இரு ஃபோக்கஸ் புல்லராக இரு அப்படின்னாரு த என்டையர் ஃபிலிம் Johnny, my job was to do the focus pulling. Oh my God. So focus pulling. So I saw the whole film through the... From the film projector's point of view and not from somebody, some onlooker point of view, you know. So that way he knew, visually he knew what was important. Right. But see, he was a very simple man. He said, I don't know how to do this technique. I need a strong cameraman. So I think... And uh, Balu Mahendra would have very strength in his composition. Right. Not his lighting. and uh, not his camera movements also because he balamendra was not interested in movements at all you know it was all solid frames and, and the ca- uh, trolley panna kuda slow ah dhan pogum you know he had a certain uh, style maximum influence would have been to cast shobha in the sto- in the in the film from him it would have come because he knew the potentials of shobha and she was perfect for the role right i don't know why they didn't work after that ah uh-huh. so that was going to be my next question yeah. to you because and the padath kapram and that such a success mm. all his films almost all See, of them were ashok maybe this thing of people around uh, saying that uh, you know ivarku you know technically la theriyadhu camera man da ellam pannaru nu so i think after a successful film there is a little bit of hurt that happens you know even though the cinematographer would have contributed you know everything goes to the uh, camera man so nala he must have thought let me do with somebody new and that was fantastic you know ashok kumar oda the way he worked was really really very good how would you differentiate or rather if an average viewer takes mullu malarum and let's say metti rendu padathukku vandu rendu me natural light la shoot panna mari da irukum rendu me nariya jaasti vandu in the realistic environment la irukum even the if a morning shot in the day for night and the marla jaasti irukadhu so when you when you look at these two films a real a lay person says in the camera aesthetic in the camera aesthetic almost same da Mm. but neenga vandu what as a, as a as a technical person what difference do you see between balu mahendra shot mullu malarum and yeah. ashok kumar shot other films of mahendra see udri pookal was definitely a trend setter because uh, we are used to backlighting of nivas and backlighting of uh, balu mahendra there was no experimental uh, low light and or uh, orange light la ellam varudhu that ashok kumar brought it okay you know which i think uh, worked very well for udri pookal and putta the pottukal if you remember putta the pottukal the whole film was shot in close ups mm-hmm. and periya pottu irukra ladies and the black hair and then the light from below if you look at all that you know so that was uh, just the opposite of how shobha or sri devi was shot by balu mahendra with bright faces and you know rimmed uh, hair yeah. and the orange uh, backlight and all that it was completely different so mullu malaru ko metti ko enna difference na mullu malaru rappo mahendra sir oda first film so he was uh, he had the commerce of the film at the back of his mind metti la hidden have he was a free flying person appapa vandu location la vandha eduvaru he talked about a middle aged woman living in a north indian's house and probably had an affair with him so he said like to hell with all these people who talk about morality and uh, you know convention kind of writing na he just wrote something off the cuff okay you know even nanjithe kilade is a lot like mullu malaram right. you know very carefully written you know uh, a girl who is running away from problems and uh, she falls in love with the wrong man and then she marries the right man you know there is a formula but metti edutina formula va kedaadu radhika is the heroine there is no hero for her there is no all the scenes are with her brother step brother amma so he let go as a writer he just let go today i think that would have been really really appreciated because uh, it was about losers right it was not about winners at all it was all losers veil pada paakumbodha i realized you know if veil could succeed with all losers <laughs> metti couldn't succeed abdin thonitha i think uh, he 
was somewhere fearless, you know. And the commerce did not matter to him, which I think was also the reason for his later film order. And the Sarivaku and the commerce ever connected to the other than the other club. Because Nigapathingana, Mullu Malarum, Metti, Ninjate Kilade, huge successes, mm. but Everything after that, almost mm, everything yeah, after that, yeah. Nandu, Poota, The Pootakal. Uh, and I did one film called Aragiya Kanne. Even the Rajini films. Even Johnny was also not a success. I mean, we were there and we were all very upset because it didn't collect the way we wanted. Even Addu was in the middle of the world, the commerce was in the middle of the Also, I think there are two things from his personal life which also affected. I don't think we need to discuss it. One was a relationship with the other one was a habit. That also... It happens. I mean, we are all human beings. Right, right. I right. mean, we can't be like uh, productive all the time. Right. You know?